I would say Spain is like an old uh, New York, that we can find people from all over the world. Well, here you cannot find maybe now people from all over the world, but you can find history from all the cultures around the world. For the rest of Europe, Spain is a center of good weather and nature, okay? But I think for Americans, this is more culture, to find the roots. Sevilla, or Seville, the capital of Andalusia province, is the quintessential image most foreigners have of Spain. Flamenco and the Spanish style of guitar that accompanies were born in Andalusia and thrive here, nurtured by artists, aficionados and teachers who have begun to spread their musical influence beyond the borders of the province and of Spain. On the map, Andalusia is just a few hours drive from Madrid, Spain's capital, but culturally the distance is considerably greater. Reinforcing the concept often put forth here that Spain is really a continent of 17 independent and distinctly different countries. Sevilla is dissected by the Rio Guadalquivir, the only navigable river in Spain. It was along these banks that Columbus and Magellan embarked on their first expeditions, adventures that changed the world dramatically, bringing fame and fortune to Spain. On Columbus's first voyage, he sailed down the Guadalquivir, through the Mediterranean port of Cadiz, another historic community. The oldest city in Europe, Cadiz, was settled in 1100 BC by the Phoenicians, a perfect location from which to extend their influence upriver and inland. With a natural safe harbor and access to the river, the port of Cadiz has, over the centuries, played an important role in the development of South Spain. <laughs> 